How are you guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be making some taco sliders. And to get started, I got a small onion and a medium sized onion that I chopped up and put in this pan. With some olive oil to saute it. And I got here two pounds of ground turkey. So we're going to saute these together. Pop right on in there. And just cook until it's thoroughly. All right, that's cooked through. So we're going to add in two taco seasoning packets. And let that simmer. Oh, and also add a little cayenne for some heat and some pepper. At this point, taste for season. I had to add a little Tony's because it wasn't quite seasoned enough. Make sure you try it out first before you serve. All right, our meat is all done. Let's move on to the slider part. Got some King Hawaiian rolls right here. I had to cut them, or well, split them in half, and one of them got a little mangled, but that's fine. It's still gonna eat good. We're gonna put it in this pan right here. Okay, we got it bad boy split in half. Now we're gonna put some sour cream on it. And just spread it out. Then we're going to sprinkle on some taco blend cheese and just completely cover the bottom. Okay. Now let's sprinkle our meat over the top. much as you like. It's your food. Alright, let's add some more cheese. Make this nice and cheesy. Now we're gonna add our last couple of toppings. Put in some chopped tomatoes. Yeah, I chopped up myself, so that's why they look a little irregular. <laughs> Do you boo get pre-chopped if you want? That's fine. Or you can leave it out if you don't like them. Whatever you want to do. And some good old lettuce. Now we put our top bun back on and brush it open with some good old garlic butter. I'll probably insert a clip of when I made it, but all I really did was get a stick of butter and chopped up two cloves of garlic, add some Italian seasoning and some Tony's Creole seasoning, and that was it. Just a little bit of seasoning to give it a little extra flavor. And brush it on. Hold the camera. Really. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. I was focused on getting that butter. That's my oven preheated. I got it at 370. I'm gonna cook this for about 10 minutes to nice the top get nice and crisp with all this good butter on it. Throw it in the oven for 10 minutes. Here they are, fresh out of the oven. Cheese is nice and melty. See it right there? All those good juices. All right. And to finish it off, sprinkle a little green onion on it. You good to go, baby? Get y'all a better view of it. <laughs> All right. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. I know this is a quick one. I'm trying to pop them out for you guys. I know I've been gone for a minute, but. You know, your boy be, he be busy working and stuff be popping up and all, but I'm back. I'm sorry I've been gone so long, but make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and I'll keep them coming. i see you in the next one. Bye. 
Oops. <laughs> Thought I was gonna let you go without I'll show you the inside of it. Look at that. Ooh. <laughs> okay, I'm going for real this time, you guys. Try it out, let me know how it turned out for you.